Smithy and I love dressing up. Don't you? Gertrude loves dressing up. And so does Wombat. Well, tonight's bedtime story is about a dad who likes dressing up. And it's called The Dressing Up Dad by Maudy Smith. Better get some specs on to do this properly. Well, Danny loved dressing up. So did Danny's dad. Danny and his dad dressed up at home and when they went out. They dressed up anywhere, at any time, whatever the weather. And there was nothing they enjoyed more than a dressing up party. For his birthday, Danny had a dinosaur party. The next year, he had a robot party. And the year after that, it was pirates. Dad was the most piratey pirate of them all. There was no one quite like Danny's dad. But sometimes Danny wondered. He wondered what it would be like to have an ordinary, everyday dad, like other people had. Your birthday's coming up, said Danny's dad. I'm really looking forward to the bugs party. What shall I come as? A ladybird? A dragonfly? Or a big, hairy spider? Danny ran upstairs. I don't want you to come to my party as a bug, he said. Not even as a beetle, said Dad. Not even as an ant. Can't you come as a dad instead? An ordinary everyday one, please. Oh, said Dad. I could try being an ordinary everyday dad, although I'm not sure I have the right outfit. But at the very back of the wardrobe, Danny found the perfect thing. Danny's dad looked great dressed up as an ordinary everyday dad. He turned out to be really good at being an ordinary everyday dad too. He took care of the guests. He organised the party games. And he made sure everyone got a slice of birthday cake. He did everything an ordinary everyday dad ought to do. But something wasn't right. We want to be chased, said Danny's friends. We want a giant caterpillar. Dad looked sad. Sorry, he said. I've got party bags, bags to organise. But Danny shouted, Wait! Put it on, Dad, go ahead. I'd love to, said Dad. But are you sure you want me to? Quite. Sure, said Danny. It was his party, but he wanted Dad to have fun too. So Dad dressed up as a giant caterpillar and Eddie Redmayne. It was brilliant! No one wanted to go home. You love dressing up, don't you, Dad, said Danny. I do, said Dad. I love dressing up with you. Well, from now on, said Danny, we can dress up together whenever you like. Ordinary everyday dads were fine. But Danny knew his dressing up dad was the best dad in the world. Well, it's bedtime for you lot and look at this wonderful array of books by Morty Smith. Go and spend all the money you've got and buy a shed load before they run out. Night, night.